Maybe and I are going to show you how to teach your dog to sit pretty, or in other words, to get up into a big position. When teaching this treat, you're going to want to have a clicker to mark when your dog has done something correct, as well as several small treats that your dog likes. You're going to first get your dog into a sit position. Then you're going to take your treat and just rock it right up over their head, keeping it very close. If the dog jumps up on their back legs, no click, no reward. But if she balances on those back legs, I'm going to click and reward. So see how she just raised up a little bit, but her bottom continues to be on the floor. That's what we want. That's really engaging her core muscles. So it takes quite a bit of strength as well as balance to do this trick. In the beginning, only have your dog do a few repetitions and for short periods of time. Otherwise, you're going to make them tired and they won't want to do the trick very much. Once your dog can easily balance up into that sit pretty position, we'll switch to an empty hand signal. So no treat in my hand. My empty hand signal is just a flat hand moving up over her head like that. Once your dog is responding consistently to the empty hand signal, you can add on a verbal cue, like sit pretty. So I'm going to say that word once and then give my empty hand signal. Sit pretty. Sit pretty. With enough repetition, the dog will begin to respond to the verbal cue alone and you won't even need to use that hand signal. That's how you start to teach your dog to sit pretty.